A traffic alert before you had to work in the morning. One of Orlando's busiest roads just shut down for a second night in a row. Colonial Drive is now closed between Orange Avenue and Garland to install a bridge and won't reopen until 6 tomorrow morning. At least that's what engineers are telling News 6's Jerry Askin. Well, right here on Colonial Drive between Garland Avenue and Orange Avenue, workers have been adding new cable for this pedestrian overpass bridge, and that has meant many weekend overnight closures even tonight, and this may impact your commute first thing tomorrow morning. If you're heading out right now, overnight, or first thing tomorrow morning, this portion of Colonial Drive, known to many as State Road 50, may be slow motion. Well, I know it's a hassle. Kevin Finley is like many drivers forced to find different routes all weekend here between Orange and Garland Avenues because Colonial Drive has been closed overnight. All because construction workers have spent the weekend adding to this new quarter mile bridge. It's aimed at making downtown more pedestrian friendly. With downtown being as busy as it is, you know, there's really no way around it. You're just trying to find an alternate route the best you can. The city of Orlando is saying the entire thing ought to be done by early 2019. The whole point is to better connect residents and visitors to Orlando's downtown neighborhoods, business districts, the Sun Rail train system, and more. A new walkway above that many drivers say makes these weekend closures all worth it. If it means that we're going to be more pedestrian friendly, you know, it brings um, uh, better people downtown, walkable people, you know, riding bikes, that kind of thing. Um, so I think it's wonderful. So Colonial Drive here reopens around 6 a.m. tomorrow. So be sure and follow the appropriate detour signs to get around this closure. In downtown Orlando, I'm Jerry Askin, News 6. On the morning news, Trooper Steve is going to be monitoring this area to see if the work is finished by 6 a.m. and if the road reopens in time. If not, he will help you get around this. The morning news starts at 5. We'll also be posting updates on clickorlando.com traffic for you.